Hello Aquarius, welcome to my channel. Hope you're all doing well. Thank you for your likes, shares and subscribes. This is the October message. Spirit, please show me the message for Aquarius. Round and round, number seven. I got this for another sign. You might think things are never coming to an end. You're going round in circles. It could be your mental thought patterns as well, um, where you can't make a decision or you're feeling it's one thing after another and the challenges are ending. Um, we'll just have a look and see what else we've got here. It could be people and situations showing up again. People coming around again you thought you'd dealt with. Situations, it's like deja vu feeling. I thought I'd dealt with this. I thought I'd put an end to all this. That type of energy as well. There's no need to worry. Okay. No need to worry about things. Nothing stays the same forever. Ask your angels. So angels don't have to be in the heavenly realm. There can be people that support you on this material earth. There's angels around us, people that you can trust and rely on. Uh, it's not always a, uh, in the sense of the point of view of uh, angels in the fifth dimension. There are angels on the third dimension, on this material earth that can help you. So we'll see what this is about. Aquarius. There we go. There's new beginnings coming in. Aces, brand new beginnings. Ace of Pentacles, there's no need to worry. Beautiful, Nine of Cups. The Devil card, that's the Devil card. That's what you're feeling at the moment. No need to worry. The Lover's card. The central energy is the Sun card, the most auspicious card, auspicious card in the deck. Beautiful. The Seven of Wands, you're in a great position here. The beautiful Queen of Cups. Now, this is what I was talking about. She's a beautiful, caring energy on this material earth. The Page of Wands, beautiful ideas, new beginnings here. And the beautiful Queen of Pentacles. Mature energies are here. There's mature energies on the table. Now, this here is the planets aligning for you. So don't be worrying about anything here, Aquarius. Things are all lining up for you. There's going to be sunshine and happiness further down the line. Uh, although it maybe doesn't feel like that yet. You might feel as if you're going round in circles and things aren't ending. But Spirit is aware of it and they're telling you that things are aligning for you and there's a lot of joy and happiness further down the line. Now, what they're saying here is this seven of wands energy is someone who's in a great position to take on challenges. Now, it's somebody who might have to defend themselves as well. So if something's coming back or something keeps coming back at you, you might have to stand your ground, right? But you're in a position now uh, it's spirit saying to take on the challenges that are needed and you've got the upper hand here sometimes you see him standing on a hill but he's defending his position he's sticking by his guns he's able to take on the challenges that's needed now this could be within a relationship so you might be going round in circles with your partner it could be a relationship that you're having that you know you're having to stand your ground with you're having there's challenges within all relationships. It doesn't mean it's a bad relationship here. So don't be worrying about it if you're having a bit of challenge with your partner uh, within your personal life. This could also be um, that things are lining up for you and you're going round and round and you think you're never going to meet anybody. Um, and suddenly you do meet someone. OK, and you're in a great position to take on all the challenges that could come along with that as well. So you have not to worry if you're looking for a relationship. And one isn't showing up because it will be coming. It will be coming along. We've got the Queen of Cups here. So don't worry about that. Now, this can also be you making the choice to stand your ground and take on your challenges. If you feel you're going round and round in circles, you're choosing to defend yourself. Because the old idea of this Gemini, this is the Gemini energy was choices. So choosing to stand your ground and take on the challenges that's necessary. Because that is what's going to bring you your happiness in the end. Things will line up for you. So don't be worrying about anything. Now, this here is going round and round. And this is the kind of stuck energy. It can feel like you're stuck. Now, it could be you're going round in circles with an addiction. It could be a toxic environment you're sick of being in. It could be a relationship that doesn't serve you well. It could be you believing that you're not able or capable of taking on things or changing things. But what Spirit's saying is, you've got to stand your ground here. You're in a great position to take on the challenges here, Aquarius. 
And everybody has the ability to move on from anything that's holding them back. So you can't have that wee big ego-based energy that's eating away and you're saying, God, I'm ne this is this never going to end? I'm never going to get out of this job or I'm never going to get out of this relationship. You will get out of it. If you want out of it, you will get out of it. And it's about standing your ground and being determined about what it is that you want to create for yourself. So working through the challenges as you go along life's path and dealing with anything that's holding you back, that you feel is holding you back. It could be a person, an environment, an addiction, like I say, or, um, you know, a relationship. But a job, this is the choosing card as well. So choosing to take on the challenges that come to move you on or bring in your sunshine. Because it's about when you move on, you choose to move on from anything that's holding you back and you stand your ground, you bring in your wish fulfillment here. And this is brand new beginnings. This is what spirit wants for you. They want a brand new beginning in your stability. They want you to move away from the stuck energy. You can sometimes in the other deck see the hands of the divine handing you this new opportunity. Aces are new beginnings. Now, this could be a windfall. It could be a lottery win. It could be compensation. It could be an inheritance. Obviously, new starts with finances could be money coming in that you didn't see. It could be a wage rise that you're hoping for. It could be that you're standing your ground and you're saying, you know, defending yourself, I'm worth more money. It could be that and a wage rise comes in. It could be your house selling. It could be going through challenges like with that. You know, it's never going to sell. All this type of energy, you feel you're going round in circles. But what Spirit's saying is you're not to worry about this because they're aware and there's brand new beginnings and stability coming in. So this could be within your finances, your home life, your relationships, your environments. Okay, anything that's holding you stuck. There's new beginnings coming in that's going to move you towards your wish fulfillment. And you're going to get out of this what you want, Aquarius. Spirit's going to help you move on when the time's right. And that's what happens. The universe has got your back. Always got your back. So asking your angels here, it's about you going towards what you're passionate about. What ideas do you have that you want to create? You're going round and round and you think, you know, I'd love to do this, this idea I've got, but I've never seemed to be getting there. Spirit's saying things are changing. You've not to worry. There's new beginnings and new opportunities coming in that are going to move you towards what it is that you want for yourself, that you're passionate about. Now, this could be the idea of leaving a job and going on a new course that eventually will bring greater stability to your life that you're going to enjoy. It could be using a skill, developing a skill that can earn you money, that could earn you money. So the idea, any ideas you have now that you about what you want to create, it's time to choose to go down the path now because there's a lot of success along the way. So don't worry about it if there's challenges. Even when we're going towards what we want, that we're happy with, that we want to create, there's always challenges of some description. But you're in a great position now to start the things up and move away from this stuck energy and go towards what your wish fulfillment here. So in the central reading here, we've got you with the idea that you want to create. It's going to bring very a lot of success and happiness to you. And there's going to be a lot of celebrate from it, Aquarius. OK, so what we've also got here is we have got this beautiful Queen of Cups. Now, she's a very caring, emotional, stable energy. So this could be you because you're making your decision to go towards your wish fulfillment. It's making you feel emotionally happy. So you're moving towards that type of energy here. It could be you meeting uh, someone who you're caring about or they're caring about you, who's very nurturing, who's giving you the opportunity to enter a relationship. Now, if it's Cups, it's Cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio, but it doesn't have to be. In this relationship, it's going to make you happy and it's going to be the start of new stability for you here. So it might be like I say that you're wanting a relationship and you think it's never going to come and you're feeling stuck being single. That's not the case. Things never stay the same forever. So this beautiful person could be coming in for you here. Like I say, if you're going towards what it is you want to create, you could be moving towards your own happiness and feeling more stable after coming away from this stuck feeling here. Now, anything you create here is going to bring this stability because this is what spirit wants for you. Brand new beginnings. So anything you put your efforts into here, this could be building a home with someone because the Queen of Pentacles is a very nurturing energy. She's somebody who's very stable. She's a homemaker. So you could be starting a family, moving in together, all that type of energy. Or this is quite, like I say, you creating something that you're good at that's going to grow for you. You know, the efforts you put in, 
um, is going to bring you financial benefits. She's very uh, secure. She's got good relationships around her. She knows where to put her energy. She puts her energies into the right kind of people, caring people, good friends, um, having a good work environment around her. Um, things grow for her because she's investing in the right people, the right environments, in the right places. Okay, and she works at it. And when she works at it, she starts to see, creates this beautiful, comfortable, secure environment for herself, which is what I say at the beginning, spirit is wanting for you. So don't worry about things at the moment, Aquarius, even if it's taken a wee bit of time, because there's help along the way. You will come away from this going round and round and feeling stuck, and you are going towards your wish fulfillment here. I will take a fairy message to end this reading, please. Wish wisely. Wish wisely. Use your wishes wisely to manifest your heart's desire and take practical steps, making your dreams come true. So it's about taking practical steps and creating what you desire for yourself and gaining from that and going towards your wish fulfillment here. I hope this helps uh, Aquarius. Please like, share and subscribe and I'll see you again soon. Bye bye.